Hey guys, so uh, this, this is a 300 millimeter Kido. Um, this thing is a monster, seriously. I, uh, I've made a 330 Suji, 320 Suji, 300 Suji, uh, but this is by far the uh, largest Kido that I've done. <laughs> Oreo. Anyway, um, yeah, th this thing's just been fun. I, uh, some of you remember I snapped the first one, and I ended up making a little 240 out of it that was just a wicked little knife. And this thing is nuts. Um, the balance is one inch, 25 millimeters in front of the heel, roughly. Um, and then the, uh, the overall weight is eight ounces, 228 grams, I think it was exactly. So yeah, look at the polish, even after the etch and, and the etch cycles, it's still, I mean, it's a mirror. But uh, how about that Hamon? So the handle is Buckeye Burrow from my personal little pile that I have. And then, uh, 165 year old wrought iron and brass and uh, it actually has some live edge stuff going on in it which I love I, I really like the natural cracked that's why I love the wrought iron you know that rough surface it looks all polished now but it, it patinas up beautifully you can see the uh, the fit this is this hasn't been mounted yet this is prior to any uh, any any wax or anything in it. <laughs> this cat's wild, by the way, if you can't tell. Anyhow, um, it still needs just a tiny bit of, of adjustment to clear up that that last little bit of uh, of gap there before I, I I mount it. But overall, that's not too bad. Pretty cool stuff. I'm really, this knife is so much fun. I uh, I did some cutting with it yesterday and with the bare blade and it just freaking flies through food. It's got a ton of forward balance and uh, as much as most of my extra heavies. And it just, I mean, with the geometry, you can cut with it, this thing anywhere on the blade. So, you can tell it's not an extra heavy. Plenty of taper. nice and thin it's actually what I would consider a laser um, even with such a big heavy knife I couldn't imagine this thing if it were a full and extra heavy thing weigh two pounds but um, cool stuff anyhow waiting for Carlos's approval on the handle and it should be mounted by tonight and uh, once it's mounted I'll get the pictures and get another video up for you guys on stuff thanks for looking